Welcome to Silver Spot Cinema. We're here at the Battery in Atlanta, Georgia, and I'd love to show you in. Come on over. Hey, Sheena. Hi, welcome to Silver Spot. We have something prepared for you. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. Hey, Max. Welcome to the S Bar, Gonzalo, where we make all of our drinks from scratch in house. I've actually got your favorite drink for you made right here. Ooh, thank you. Of course. I'm gonna try it. Delicious. Hi, welcome to Silver Spot. My name's Jenner and I'll be assisting you with any purchasing of tickets as well as any questions you may have for me today. Continue right this way for a great experience. Thank you. Hello, welcome to Silver Spot and enjoy the movie. Thank you, Kiana. So here we are in Auditorium One. It has 50 seats. It's small, but it's very intimate. And it has a gigantic screen. So the experience is amazing. Welcome back, Gonzalo. So you have our margarita, which is a great choice. Can I grab you something to eat right away? Yeah, you know what? I have my favorite, the mini smash burgers. Absolutely. I'll have that come out to you right away, OK? Very good. Cody, remember to credit my points. Right. I, absolutely, I got you. Thank you. The company was founded by my grandfather in 1947, so it's been 74 years. I am third generation. He was an Italian that lived in Genoa, and he decided to take an adventure and get on a ship and go and head to Brazil. So at that time, the ships that crossed the Atlantic they would stop at Venezuela to replenish and to restock. He was very, with a very good friend, and uh, they got off the boat, and they just loved it, and they decided to stay there. He was 20 years old by then. Then he married uh, my grandma, uh, she was a Venezuelan, and he start, his business started being importing uh, Italian goods. So he will bring in uh, Pirelli tires, which you may know, uh, also Perugina chocolates, and uh, Zegna fabrics for suits and stuff. But being an Italian in the Second World War, uh, and Venezuela being a strong ally of the US and all the countries that were against uh, the Nazis, uh, he was blacklisted. So all his accounts were frozen and he could not work. By then, he had an investment in one, of the, one theater. And so he didn't have anything to do. He didn't have a job. He was very limited. He just started going and spending time there. He was a, a very hardworking person. And a year after, he had uh, you know, bought the shares from his um, associates. And that's how this company was founded. And so um, all of this was in Venezuela. At some point, we started looking outside. And we went to Argentina and Chile. And um, we bought there actually a circuit from, uh, that was owned by them by Hoyts and AMC. And then we started looking into the US. And in 2009, we opened our first theater in Naples, Florida. And 12 years after, here we are with our several locations. So Silver Spot is the ultimate dining and movie experience. It's for guests that want to have a more refined and modern movie watching. We summarize our concept in a very simple way. It's best of worth worlds. We have a passion for film. We offer a broader option to our guests. We'll have, of course, Hollywood blockbusters, but in addition, we have some independent and what we call smart films. Um, and also operas and concerts and, and any other content. Now, it is the love for food and drink that brings them back. We want their, mo their mouth to water, thinking of what they had and what they want to repeat. And then everything, it's enveloped really by our customer service. It is r the human touch. It is the connection. It is the acknowledgement that you exist. And it is the enjoyment of serving and smiling and making sure our guests have a remarkable experience. Oh, and by the way, here's Nick. Hey, Gonzalo, here's your uh, 
many smash burgers. Mm, thank you so much. Thank you. So Nick, I have a couple of questions. Tell us a little bit about your vision on the food and beverage offer to our guests. Well, it's simple. Our vision uh, coming from the culinary and beverage aspect of things is fresh, uh, chef driven and 100% uh, scratch kitchens. Very good. Give us an example. Uh, so our jasmine rice bowls uh, is a very complicated dish with many fresh ingredients that uh, uh, hopefully you guys will be tasting soon. And I can attest that one is awesome and it's a big seller. And um, I know you also go the extra mile on sauces, for example. Yeah, we make uh, uh, almost all of our sauces in-house, everything from our garlic cream sauce all the way to all of our salad dressings. Very good. Well, thank you so much, Nick. And I'm now going to enjoy my mini smash burgers, which I love. Yeah, have a good day. So folks, that's it for me. Thanks for watching. I'm going to pass it on to Paul. He's going to talk about our brand pillars that f give us a framework and guide us on the way that we behave. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. And I'm going to go for my mini smash burgers. All right, welcome Silver Spotters. Really excited to kick off your first day of your career here at Silver Spot. What we're gonna do is we're gonna talk a little bit about our brand pillars, what makes us different um, from our competitors and what really is our core values. Silver Spot is the ultimate movie and dining destination for film lovers with an appetite who enjoy a more refined and modern place to watch movies. So team, we're gonna really talk about these five pillars and this will engage us and you into delivering that premium Silver Spot experience. The first one is outstanding service. So our philosophy is to value our guests and treat them with respect and politeness. We acknowledge their presence, we make eye contact, we greet them, we smile, and we say thank you. We make our guests feel like special individuals and sincerely want them to have a relaxing, quality experience every time they visit Silver Spot. It is our human touch and connection while delivering the services that makes the difference. Eye contact, critically important to every single guest that you, um, that you come across, you wanna make sure that you're making eye contact. Saying thank you, being polite, it really makes that guest feel at home and very, very comfortable. Our team members are knowledgeable about their department and in general about the cinema. They know what to do and how to do their duties very well. They are conscious of their overall appearance and are properly dressed. They are upbeat and actively engage our guests with smiles, charm, and personality. How important is it to have um, to show your personality off. We hired you to have this, uh, to show off your personality and um, to show off your charm. All right, let's talk about our second pillar, relaxed luxury. Silver Spot is designed to create a unique experience. Our design delivers an airy, clean, flowy, comfy, and modern space that resembles more of a boutique hotel than a traditional big multiplex. When you folks came in today, I'm sure you noticed going to the bathroom, the marble, the big red doors, um, the seats you're sitting in right now, the leather seats that recline all the way down. We take pride in all the little things that make the big things uh, amazing about Silver Spot. Our dress code represents the brand with clean, relaxed, and design conscious uniforms. Every day when you folks come in uh, to work, you, you want to look sharp, right? And that's going to set the tone for your whole day. So when you come in, your, your shirts are ironed, you're, you're looking sharp, you're feeling great. So look great, feel great. Um, Let's talk a little bit about the walls. The black, uh, the black auditorium soundproof. We want to make sure that the doors are closed in the auditoriums to really create that memorable experience for our guests. Let's move on to delicious food and drinks. Um, cuisine that simply tastes delicious and made with fresh quality ingredi and ingredients made to order in our, full, uh, in our full kitchens. We are a scratch kitchen. Um, obviously, you've had some of our food and drinks throughout this week, um, and they're amazing. We take a lot of pride in, in the scratch part of our kitchen. We don't have sauces out of bags. We make everything from scratch. That is something we want to talk to our guests about, and that's something that will really impress our guests. You'll notice the difference 
difference even before you take your first bite. It's a meal worth going out for. We've created a craveable menu with variety of fanfares our guests rave over. Craveable, using uh, keywords like that, craveable, delicious. When you're describing the menu to our guests, it really should be um, with a lot of passion because we put a lot of passion into our food and beverage. Each dish is curated to be easy to eat in the auditorium while watching a film. It's critically important that we do have these types of dishes uh, because we are in an auditorium and we, we are on a, a, you know, it can get dark. So we want to make sure that easy to eat food that's extremely delicious. Presentation is of the utmost importance, be it in our plateware or disposable packaging. Um, you eat with your eyes first, uh, and, and that's the first thing. The second thing is the garnish. Uh, we want to have beautiful garnishes on our plates, and then obviously the taste. Again, when we talk about the Scratch Kitchen, uh, the taste is just amazing. Nothing in a bag. We make everything from scratch. Spotless facilities. We pride ourselves on well-maintained building infrastructures, including furniture, equipment, floor and wall finishes, and more. We strive to ensure cleanliness, leaving no st stone unturned, and we take pride in pick up popcorn from the floors. It might be funny to th uh, say that line, picking up popcorn from the floors. Uh, we're obviously a movie theater, and we do serve a lot of popcorn. You'll see uh, while you're walking through the theater on an everyday basis that there sometimes are going to be things on the floors. Take your time to stop and pick those items up. Those are the little details that the guests are seeing. If there's popcorn on the floor or anything like that, it seems messy and that we're unattentive. Our restrooms are clean and odorless. Vanity's countertops are dried, faucet hand were wiped, and mirrors clean. Not a speck of used paper tissues or towels should be found in sight. Again, really just talking about the, the, that spotless appearance, that cleanliness, and, uh, um, and when our guests are walking into these magnificent bathrooms, we don't want garbage all around. Um, just like if a guest was to come into your home and use your restroom, your, your, your bathroom, you don't want to see, um, you don't want to have things laying around or or, or toilet paper on the ground. You want to present well, and that's what we're trying to do uh, with the spotless facilities. We aim to keep our back of the house areas clean and well organized. You hear the old adage, oh, if the restrooms are dirty, what does the back of the house look like? What does the kitchen look like? Um, so please, please, while you're working every single day, make a conscious effort to pick up any, any trash around you um, or in, in, in the guest site or also in the back of the house where the guests can't even see. I would, I would tell the bartenders that are in the, um, the room today, take a look, uh, come back from around the bar and take a look what the guest is seeing. Sit at the bar and see is it messy over here? Do I have a spill over here? Always take it from the guest's perspective. It's very, very important. Curated content. So here at Silver Spot, um, we have a event cinema. We have operas, concerts, flashback. Flashback might be the old movie that you were so excited to see in the theater um, or at home. Um, we bring that back to, to the theater. So something from the 1980s, mom and dad, grandma and grandpa, um, just really cool content there. Operas. Uh, the Met Opera in New York. We do a lot of operas here and, and our guests really engage in that and you'll see that you'll have a following for those operas. You'll have a following for the flashbacks. Um, that's how we start getting that following. Independent films that everyone is talking about. Film festivals. In North Carolina we do a film festival. In Miami we do, we do a film festival. Um, and that's just an opportunity to really show off our beautiful theaters um, with our, our, our awesome teams and and, and to really, uh, special events, special events, directors and writers Q&As, in-house movie events, wine tasting and food festivals paired with a film festival tie-in. Um, it's a great venue for private showings. One of the things that we did uh, is we put an Apple TV into every single auditorium. So the guests can rent out those auditoriums and, and come in and put any content they want. They could watch um, the Final Four. Uh, they can watch anything that they could stream. How amazing is it that they can put on whatever they want from their streaming service with a small group of their friends and family? That's a huge win for Silver spot and it's something that we do differently that other uh, movie theaters don't do. And then e-gaming. 
Um, again, you can hook up through that Apple TV. You could hook up PlayStation 5. You can hook up Xbox. And just, again, spend that time with your friends and family um, in a small, intimate uh, theater setting. Team, welcome again. Um, that's it for me. Next up is going to be Pete Smith from Coconut Creek to talk to you a little bit about your career and his career here at Silver Spot. Thanks, Paul. Hi, everybody. My name is Pete Smith. I'm general manager here at Silver Spot Cinema, and we're super excited to have you as part of our team. Now, whether you were watching this video either from the comforts of one of our cinemas or at, at your home, um, we'll let you know that the people that you're going to see in this presentation today are starting exactly where you are. Whether they were a line cook or a concessionist, uh, ITS server, or a runner for our company, those people have evolved into the leaders that we have today, our managers, our general managers, and our executive kitchen managers. The environment that we work in, um, it's very fast paced, a lot of moving parts, control chaos we like to call it. But at the end of the day, it's really about seeing the, the smiles on the guests' faces. That's what makes our job so rewarding. So in closing, I want to say the sky's the limit. We're invested in you and want to see you be the best person you can be here at Silver Spot. So thanks again for your time and I look forward to seeing you around real soon. Hello. My name is David Maddox and I'm the Director of Operations for Silver Spot Cinemas. And I'd like to personally welcome you to the ultimate theater experience, where we combine outstanding service and hospitality, dynamic projection and sound, and a premium food and beverage program. You most likely are watching this from one of our seven locations. Perhaps it was our original location in Naples, Florida, or our second location in Coconut Creek, Florida. From there, we went up to Chapel Hill, North Carolina, and then we actually came back down to Miami, Florida, which we love. If not one of those, it could be further north, which would be Pinecrest, Ohio, or Brookfield, Wisconsin. After that, we came down to our newest location here in Georgia at Battery Park. And again, welcome to Silver Spot Cinemas, where we combine dynamic projection and sound, amazing food and beverage, and outstanding service. And remember, you make the difference. Thank you.